Hey dolls, so today I am doing the get to know me tag and I noticed that my subscribers are like slowly increasing so I thought this would be like the perfect time to finally do this tag. Hopefully by the end of this video you will know me a little better. <laughs> Let me pull up the questions. All right, so the first set of questions are the vital sets. Um, name, my name is Rosalyn. It means beautiful rose. Nicknames, most of my friends just call me Rose. Um, Rara, Roz, Rosie, Rosie, something like that. But in general, most people just say Rose or they just say my birthday. <laughs> um, birthday, my birthday is April the 26th, which is in a month and a half, so happy early birthday to me. Yes. <laughs> okay, um, place of birth, I was born in South Dallas, that's Texas. Star sign, I'm a Taurus, I got the tag. Um, occupation, hmm. So I'm a full-time student, but you know, there's YouTube and then I have my cosmetology license. So I do like hair on the side, you know, for the extra money. And hair color is dark brown, like, you know, like a 1B. <laughs> That's the color of my hair. Um, hair length, I actually just got this haircut not too long ago. I know it's a little frizzy right now. Well, kind of a lot of frizzy right now because it was raining outside. And you know, natural hair is equivalent to a frizz <laughs> when it rains, of course, but whatever, it's still cute. I like it. But yeah, so this is my hair length right now. I can just spin around and show y'all. You know what it looks like. It was supposed to be in like a bob when I first put it, but that was like literally like two, three weeks ago and I already have like an extra inch back. So now I had to bump it up there like this morning or whatever, but it's cool. At least I get to rock this short style for at least a little while before my hair grows back. Okay, what's next? Um, Eye color, brown, best feature. Mm, what do I think? I don't know. I, I feel like I would say my eyes, I suppose. Even though I like my I like my smile, I would say maybe my eyes or my smile, maybe my dimples. All right, I wanna say all three of those, but I'm gonna just pick one, I would say my eyes. <laughs> okay, Um. let's see, what else? Uh, braces. So I don't have braces, obviously, but I did have braces in seventh and eighth grade. Let's see. Piercings, um, I have my belly button pierced, but I never wear it. So usually if you see me, I'll probably just be showing my scar. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I just don't like wearing it. It always gets stuck to everything. So I don't like it. Um, my ears, I have three on, I had four actually on each side of my ears, but you know, Anyways, I wear like, I wear the two on this side, like, yeah. And then I wear these two and I wear this one. So I wear three on this side and two on this side. And then obviously I have my face piercing. No, this is not a dermal, it's a piercing. I did have a dermal before, but it kept rejecting. So once they healed, I just pierced it. Like, you know, like you would pierce your eyebrow, but I just put it right here. That's all my piercings. All right, tattoos. I have a tattoo here that says love, um, it's hidden. All my tattoos are hidden and they will stay that way. Um, I have a tattoo on my thigh that says Taurus. And actually me and my girlfriend are going to get more tattoos for my birthday. So I'll have a tattoo here possibly, maybe one on my back, who knows? But I know for sure here because there's something that I want to put there. But yeah, okay. Righty or lefty? I write 
with my right hand, but I do everything else with my left, like everything else, including home my phone and text and everything. It's like I drive with my left hand, I eat with my left hand, I would do remotes with my left hand. I don't even know. I do everything with my left hand and that's mostly so my right hand since it's kind of my dominant hand, you know. It's always free just in case, like you never know something might happen. I need to have one hand free, free at least and it's gonna be my dominant hand. First best friend, mm, my, I must say my first real best friend because best friend because I always had best friends. Like I always thought I had a best friend, like so many people. But I must say my first like real Ride or die, like strong, like super connected, like best friend was this girl named Kiara, and yeah, we were best friends when I was in like sister. She was in seven, and that was until literally until I was in high school until my tenth grade year, I guess, because I ended up moving in tenth grade to like the suburbs, and we kind of just like lost connection I didn't have no phone and you know how that goes <laughs> so that's look but that's that um my first award my first award I feel like it was like maybe I was super little my first award so it was like a AB on the world type of award um my first sport I do not know I played a lot of different sports but I never like really played them it was like okay i played baseball for maybe like a month i played i played basketball for about a few weeks <laughs> i did track for maybe like another few weeks or like a month like i literally i did like everything but i never stayed into anything like all the way to the first end. concert like, oh my first concert was i went to go see um, i don't even remember their what's their names um, it's this little boy group not one direction <laughs> no but anyways i went to see them and like tyler was there and you know like young money and that was that favorite film is deja vu with holly berry and um denzel washington first and foremost that's my favorite film ever <laughs> uh tv shows Grey's anatomy scandal those are my top two i think and then empire quantico um, this new thing I saw on Netflix called um, The Return. What else do I be watching? What's this other show? The 100, 4400. Um, dang it, this one Netflix show that is so bomb. Like, it got like these eight people. Since eight, those are the shows that I really like to watch. Oh, yeah, you know, when just have been black. I like all that kind of stuff. My favorite color is pink and then gold and then like light blue and purple. And I like light colors, like spring colors. I don't have a favorite restaurant. I don't have a favorite food. My favorite store is Charlotte Roos. I buy everything from there. This top came from there. Um, favorite book. I don't think I have like a favorite. I have like favorite artists. I have like, like probably 10 favorites. Like, yeah, I don't have that many favorite stuff. Let's see, what else? Currently, I am feeling happy. Am I single or taken? I'm taken. Um, wearing this top from Charlotte Russe again, like this bando top, and this cute little um, dream catcher, and just these black pants, and that's it. Future, do I want children? Mm, do I wanna be married? I guess if I get married, then of course we might want a family after that that's all i can really say but as for i'm not like one of those people just like oh i can't wait to have kids i'm more like oh i can't wait to adopt like stuff like that i'm not matter of fact i'm not even like oh i can't wait to adopt because i can't wait i just want to finish school <laughs> that's like the first thing on my mind careers in mind um careers in mind no it's more like career that I am currently pursuing. I major in medical laboratory science. So I want to be a medical laboratory technologist or like like a middle that's the same thing as like a medical laboratory um scientist. So that is my dream job. Like where I'm headed. I only got two more years. Just gotta get through these two more years 
and do goal achieved all right let's see where do i where do i want to live i guess texas is home it's where the heart is so i will always live in texas but i would like to travel though you know be open-minded and learning things see new things do you believe in god yes i do miracles yes i do ghost i believe in ghosts man i have some story times on some stuff like that aliens yeah i do believe that there's you know of course other existence other you know um life forms throughout our universe like you know how freaking small our universe is like i mean like our um planet is like in our universe and it's just like so ugh, i just i I can't even explain what I'm trying to say. It's weird, like, there's so much that we don't know. Like, guys, y'all need to always be open-minded because, trust me, you don't know everything. I think I know everything, but I know I don't know everything. Like, I don't know nothing. The more I learn, the more I realize, I don't know <laughs> Okay, like, I had a really religious family. And when you are a part of, like a family that like had all these religious views and blah 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 and then you are also like you have this passion for science they kind of at first they bump heads but you gotta kind of pull from both parts do i believe in soulmates yes do i believe in hell i believe that all people are all evil people are going somewhere <laughs> somewhere <laughs> Um, do I believe in myself? Yes, I believe in myself. I can do this. <laughs> I believe in myself. I think I still believe in humankind as it is. Like, even though we've been going through so much stuff, just everybody really. I mean, being born with the skin you have as a um, person of color, that's already like a struggle just because of, you know, society. But I still believe in people like I don't know why but I do <laughs> I guess I'll be trying to see the good good in people some people it's just I don't know maybe there ain't no but I still believe in, human, in the human race I still think we can do this <laughs> you know just as long as Trump don't become president but anyways so I hope you guys you know know me a little better thank you all for watching please like and subscribe if you have any questions um i can do a q a video so you can ask those questions and whatever you want to know and i can just add those to whenever i do a question and answers video anyways peace and love